expecting it to be, you know, and, and, and we're gonna maybe do one or two more before we break and then come back and just uh, take it to another level heading out of here. Um, I have Sister Ivory, please, would you honor us? How's everyone doing? I really don't have much to say about this piece except for the piece itself. So let's just get to it, shall we? All right. I'm waiting on the musician. <laughs> Okay. Love is a freestyle thing. Something organic like Mother Earth loving the seed enough to let it sprout. Love is a freestyle thing. Like being thankful for pictures the Creator made in the sky. Headed to the bus stop, making my hips swing. Love is a freestyle thing. Like the caress of two warm, loving parents when the elements take their natural course and they look at each other and speak with their eyes. Would you mind if I touched, if I kissed, if I held you tight? Y'all know what I mean. Love is a freestyle thing like loving kids that may not be yours but they reside in your village enough to tell them that you don't mind spanking they behind for not pulling their pants up and if they mama got a problem she can get it too because this is a love thing love is a freestyle thing love is a freestyle thing like Seeing someone in passing and giving a smile because you don't know whether or not they need it to brighten their day. And in that moment, God sent you to be that person's ray of sun. Love is a freestyle thing. That's right. Love is a freestyle thing like young men that don't know you, but they see a queen passing and they open the door for you. And you're humble enough to turn around and say thank you. Love is a freestyle thing. Love is a freestyle thing. Like babies of different races playing together because they don't know anything about the color of that skin. They just know about the spirit that's in its little box inside. That spiritual thing we call a human experience that wants us all to experience love and joy and ecstasy and patience and way other ways than the things that we're taught on these idiot box TV screens. Love is a spiritual thing. Love is a spiritual thing like a woman that looks in the mirror and speaks to her reflection i will not lay down with a man that will create nations with me because my box is too good for that love is an organic thing like a man proud polished black like a mahogany statue somewhere in kimmy's lost archives looks in the mirror and says hey I'm worth too much. I'll be damned if I plant my seed in polluted soil. Love is a thing that starts with self. Love is a thing that is contagious like breath. Love is a thing like a step towards conjuring heaven down on earth, but they don't know about all of that. I'm just talking. Love is a harmonious thing like this very moment in time and what y'all don't know is this poem was a freestyle indigo muse
May 13th. Blank face, soapstone, my throne, no clones, dripping lyrical honey from my beehive drones or waspiness at the behest of my ego. I grow, I go, you'll know soon enough. <laughs> the original rapper, your first hip hop artist, was the ancient African warrior who told his stories of triumph or defeat over a drum beat. Ever wondered why rappers always say, give me a beat? Well, that beat is the sacred bata of the heart. And what does rap even stand for anyway? Rhythm and poetry. So why not experience it in its raw form? You know, the open style, blaze the mic, spit the bars, poetic gospel. Oh, yes. So if you aren't afraid, then join us at 6 p.m. for Rhyme, the Underground Gospel. That's 6 p.m. Central Standard Time, that is, for an hour of straight bars from everyday people. And who knows, you may hear a few of Mama's rhymes, only on your mystic musical haven on the airwaves, 222.9, The Mothership, Beam Up.